Hey guys, Amy Lover here, and as you may know if you've been on my channel already, if <coughs> excuse me, if this is your first time watching one of my videos or even on my channel, um, I recently just went to Amy North. Actually, Amy North just ended yesterday, so today's Monday, and yesterday was Sunday, and I was there for the whole weekend. And I'm gonna show you all the things I bought, merchandise-wise, not manga, because. The video would be really, really long if I added in the manga. Like, the manga video is going to be like a half an hour because it's, I have so much manga and I just want to talk to you guys and everything. But even the merchandise video is going to be quite long. But I have some of the posters on the wall. I have all the posters I bought on my walls, so that will make it things a bit faster. But I guess the first thing I'll show you is my buttons I got. And these ones are not company-made. They're like... um these were artist alley buttons so i'm going to show you them and i'm going to tell you guys the prices but i never realized it till now that i got ripped off with the one button and i'll show you the buttons i got kind of all well, price wise though they, they were worth it i would but like the deal i never really thought about how like the deal wasn't too good but whatever so i got three sizes of buttons and there's all none of them are doubles Except for, I got two different Nagisa ones, but whatever. So first, um, I'll show you, I got fairy tale pins. So I got gray, Urza, Happy, what is it, Happy, Happy, Lucy, and Natsu. So those are all these ones. So those were every single fairy tale button they had. Other than the symbol, but I wanted character buttons. And then I got two Gurn Logan ones because I'm watching it right now and I really like it. I just got past the time skip. But um, there's Big Bro. Um, I'm forgetting their names right now. And then that kid. Alright, so I'll show you the medium sized buttons. And for seven buttons, it was $5. And these are really small buttons. Like, I'll compare the sizes after. But then these ones were three for five. And the one I bought for $2. So this is this one I never got the deal with. This one I just bought for $2. So Nagisa. And these are the deal buttons. So I got Waving Miku. Because there's different types of Miku. Sayatama from One Punch Man. And Madoka from Madoka Magica. Um, and so those are the, that, those, that's these. And then these ones were three for five as well. And these are big buttons. So three for five for these small ones and three for five for these big ones. So that's like kind of where I got ripped off, but whatever. So a big Umaru button. I got a Nagisa button, and I got a Ken Kaneki button, um, and I'll compare the sizes. So this is um, the large button compared to the medium button compared to the small button. So they're quite different in sizes. Um, Next, I will show you my body pillow <laughs> I got. So I got an Anagisa body pillow. Um, there's the whole thing. And I paid $60 for this pillow. And I got it the second day of Anime North. And the reason why I got it, the first day I saw the body pillows and I saw Anagisa body pillow, I wasn't going to get it until all my friends ended up getting body pillows. And I'm like, okay. I don't want to be the only one that didn't. So I went and I got an Anagisa body pillow. And I don't regret it. Not at all. Alright, so next I'll show you my plushie. And I got a Monokuma plushie from the game and an anime um, Danganronpa. Rompen. Danganronpan. So I got Monokuma. And he's so cute. I love him. So, yeah. The next thing I'm going to show you are the, um, some... Things I got, I was on the Hitalia Party um, game show type thing, and I got it to the finals, and I got third place, and I ended up winning some prizes. I ended up getting a magazine, but I gave it away because it was a 2004 magazine and everything, and it wasn't that good. 
but I got this petite nundroid. I don't know what the anime is, but she's so cute. So if you know who or where she's from, leave it in the comments below. So she's so cute. And like, even with like the small nundroids, you can take off like the front hair piece and like change the face and everything. And I think that's really cool. And I went to the Good Smile booth to look at figures um, after I got this one. And this one was selling for like... $14, like the blind box that this was in, so I definitely am happy that I got her for free. And also at the Hitalia party thing, I ended up winning this Inuasha pin, uh, like dangly charm. And it's a nice metal one, so I like it. I'll hold it. I thought that was cute. That's like the little fox boy. And then I ended up buying like this, like laser, oh not laser, a flashlight. I just have to put batteries in it, but it's Aquarius's key and it's a flashlight. So there's like the tiny button and then the light up there. So what I thought would be cool is, let's say if I ever cosplay Lucy, um, I can like open the gate and like shine the light. And yeah, so I'll show you the posters before I show you my big thing I got. So all the free posters so um all of those three so that one that one and that one for those three it was fifteen dollars and these two and a different poster that i gave away um was three for ten and also oh and also this i paid five dollars for and it was originally fifteen and then the last day i bought it and it was at five <coughs> I, this is the last thing I bought, and this is going to be a set that I'm going to buy. I'm going to get the second one that came with it. Um, and yeah, it was, the first day was like $80, and the last day I found it for 35 and I'm happy. Madoka Magica, Madoka figure from the movie. And she's beautiful. I love this figure. I just have to get her in her base properly. But um, she's a band presto figure. I have her box up there. Like I keep my boxes for my figures. But she's so pretty. I love this figure. There's even like I'm not sure if the camera picks it up, but there's it's the dress isn't just painted white. It has it's painted in shading as well. So like. Um, let's say you put her in, like, a, a, a shelf where, like, there's light going all around her and there is none of that shading that you would normally see just sitting on a shelf. Like, it has, like, pink tint within the dress and then the bow is a nice, like, bright, shiny white, the same as her shoes. So her dress is, like, a matte and her legs and her face and everything are matte and then the bow is shiny. And her hair is like so nice. Oh, such a nice figure, and it was really cheap. So I picked it up, and oh, she's so pretty. I love this figure. This is like my new, like, this is my centerpiece within all my figures. Oh, yeah, and I got one other thing, and I forgot to grab it. Alright. Um,. Then I got this fan. This was the last day I bought this fan. And it was only $3, so I was like, why not? And I forgot something else, too. I bought these two at the exact same time, at the exact same booth, so I paid $5 for the two. And I forget what this show's called, but I really like the idea of the show. Like, Anna and people living underwater, and... Just people living on land and then seeing how they coexist. Co it's I love this show. I forget what it's called, but then the time skip. Oh my god. But that's that sticker, and it's a waterproof sticker, so you can put it on like on a car or something. But me, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with it. I bought it just because. Um. But, yeah, so I'm just going to keep it in here, and when I find something to put this on, then I will take it off and put it on something. Maybe if I get, like, a laptop, I'll just, like, put it on a, I'll get my own laptop, and I'll put it on a laptop or something. I don't know. 
And then there's this fan, and this fan has, like, a description on Blue Exorcist, and I paid $3 for it. But it's not bad, because it was, like, 41 degrees, I think, the last time I checked when I was in Toronto. And it was hot, so a fan was very handy. Even though it was blowing warm air at me, at least it was something, like, blowing. Because it was, it's a nice fan, like, it blows a lot of air. And then even just as a decorative piece, it's nice looking, the flames and everything. I like it. Um, yeah, so that's everything I got merchandise-wise. My manga video, I'll either be posting today or tomorrow. I'm not even sure if I'm going to post this one today, so this one might be posted mon today, Monday, or tomorrow, Tuesday. Um, so yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe for more. Um... Tell me what was your favorite item within this pile of stuff, including posters. And um, if you watch free, tell me your favorite free boy down below. Alright, um, bye guys.